the maiden flight of SSLV D1 just now completed. The SSLVs, all stages performed as expected. The first stage uh, performed as, and separated. The second stage performed and separated. The third stage also performed and separated. And uh, we had in the terminal phase of the mission some data loss is occurring and we are analyzing the data and uh, we will come back on the status of the satellites and as well as the vehicle performance soon. So until then, uh, please bear with us that we are currently in the process of analyzing the data to conclude on the final outcome of the mission with respect to a stable orbit achieved or not. So please, come, we, please wait and we'll come back. Thank you so much for your patient uh, uh, no, viewing of this uh, live telecast from SDS HR. Thank you so much once again. All right, essentially this exciting and historic moment when the SSLV has been launched into space and currently the progress of this mission is being tracked, of course. Now this is the maiden flight of ISRO's smallest launch vehicle, the SSLV D1. And what it's carrying is essentially on Azadi Sat is an 8 kg microsatellite, which is carrying 75 small payloads, which has been developed by an all-girls team from 75 rural schools across India. Now, why 75? Of course, it's ahead of India's 75th independence anniversary. And it's important to note that this launch marks the culmination of a project that the students in these schools uh, began six months ago. Now, it's an, an exciting moment, and I think one thing to note about this is that Azadi Sat is also carrying a recorded version of the national anthem, which was sung by Rabindranath Tagore. Now, this is going to be playing in space in order to pay tribute to India. And another space song, which was prepared specially for this, will also be launched later today. Now, with this exciting and historic moment, we're heading into a very short break.